history and actually win this game and the coin toss just happened and I have the choice between receiving the kickoff or deferring the kickoff for now and I'm going to defer it. So uh, we are going to kick off in the first half to the Alabama Crimson Tide and I am going to again be running the Texas Longhorns. Um, the uh, Alabama Crimson Tide, obviously one of the best teams in football, and you can see over here on the sidebar, we're going to have uh, we're going to have uh, two little stat boxes. One um, will uh, one does like the play probability or something, win probability, and then the other one um, will do the um, will keep track of uh, certain players on the day. So. Um, uh, or, yeah, certain players, certain statistics so far on the day. So, um, going over the Crimson Tide offense, you've got um, Ja'Cory Brooks at flanker. You have uh, John, John Muir Gibbs at running back. The quarterback is Bryce Young. Uh, wide receiver is Kobe Prentice. Split end is Jermaine Burton. And on the front line, you've got left tackle Tyler Steen. Left guard J Javine Cohen. Center Seth McLaughlin. Right guard Emil Ikeoya Jr. Right tackle J.C. Latham. And you will have Cameron Latou out at tight end. So with that having been said, we're going to put in the nickel defense, and I am going to uh, look for the pass to start the game out here. And they run the ball. But we do get them relatively quickly. Um, they only get three yards on that run. That's not too bad. I think I will look for the um, run again. Or the, uh, well, no, I guess I will look for, I'll look for the run. Yeah. And, but now he's going to pass. Of course he's going to pass now. Let's hope he's incomplete. He is not, and we cannot stop him from getting a first down with that. So that was a uh, completed pass that gives uh, Alabama a first down. And as you can see over here in these boxes, Young so far today is 1 for 1 for 11 yards. And Brooks so far today has one reception for 11 yards and zero touchdowns. You might want to keep it. Uh, track of that if you want to watch that and uh, first down 35.4% um, whatever that means I don't I'm not really sure but I got the boxes up there in case you know what it means I'm gonna look for the pass coming out here on first down again and uh, and they do and we meet them and I think they got uh, maybe they got a yard they got, no, they lost two yards, so they've got a second and 12. I am going to, now I'm going to look for the run again. Oh, he's going to pass. I thought maybe he would, oh, and he overshot his target. That's great. All right, so they got a third and 12 now. Now we're going to look definitely for the pass. And he is passing, but we can't stop him, even though we were looking for it. So Young is 2 of 3 today for 9 yards, and uh, Gibbs has 0 receptions for 0 yards. I don't know why that's pertinent, why they would add that in there. But anyway, let's go look for the run. I mean, this is Alabama. They're a very good team. Although, and like I said, in real life, Texas almost beat the Crimson Tide, so... Uh, we will have to see if we can make that work. It's going to be a second and five. I'm going to look pass again. And there is a flag on the play, and Bryce Young is out of the pocket and on the run. We stop him, but who's that? Uh, we, it remains to be seen who the penalty is on. Although they did let him play out the, the uh, play, so it might have been on us. No, it isn't, so I'm going to accept the penalty for sure. 
So they got a second and 15 on their own 46. I'm going to look for the pass. Oh! And he hands it off real quick. We stop him before the first down. But hopefully that's another penalty on them. Uh, They did let him run out to play, though, so I don't know. Oh! I'm going to accept it. So I am going to look for the pass. I mean, they can run from second and 25 if they want. And they do. And we still can't stop them really well. It's kind of a problem for us, I think. But uh, And will continue to be probably this entire game. But they do have a third and 12 now, and I am going to look for the pass. And he is passing. Now, if we could just break up this pass somehow, that would be great. And we do, and so they are going to have to punt to us. So we do force Alabama to punt on their first uh, possession. But we were helped by two penalties, and you don't want to rely on that uh, too often throughout the game. I am going to try to run with the ball. And uh, we don't go anywhere. But at least, if I mean, if I'd let it bounce, it's a possibility they would have downed it like at the two or something. But anyway, uh, let's try a flat pass to the tight end. And that's going to be incomplete. And let's go over the Texas offense. You have uh, running back Bijan Robinson. Quarterback is Quinn Ewers. You've got split end Jordan Whittington. Tight end is Gunnar Helm. Left tackle is Kevin Banks Jr. Left guard is Hayden Connor. The center will be Jake Majors. Right guard is Cole Hudson. The right tackle is Christian Jones. Jatavian Sanders is at tight end. And you've got a Xavier Worthy at flanker. So let's uh, try something a little uh, more substantial here. We're going to go short to the flanker. And that's incomplete. Off his fingertips. So we got a third and ten coming up from deep, deep in our own territory. So that's not good because even a punt is going to give them good field position. Um, yeah, why, three wide receivers. Let's go short to the flanker. Let's go short to the flanker. And uh, he does get it out there, and he does get some yards. It's going to buy us a few yards for the punt, but that's about the best it's going to do because I am not going to try to go for it down here against the uh, Alabama defense, which is supreme against the pass, by the way. So we are going to punt the ball. 0-0 here with 10 minutes left in the first quarter between in a game between the Alabama Crimson Tide and the Texas Longhorns and he lost yards on that return which is good I was hoping we could force a fumble or some sort of a turnover but uh, we didn't and let's go I'm going to start out with the balanced defense here and uh, well we'll see what he does and it's incomplete nice so Bryce Young's pass is incomplete. They probably will show in the box what he is doing today. He is 3 of 6 for 23 yards. So let's uh, look for the pass. Second down, we're going to look for the pass. And he is passing. That doesn't really mean anything, but it's incomplete. He missed his target on that one. And now they've got a third and 10. I realize this is college football. He could probably run the ball here on third down and get the first down, but I am going to look for the pass. Nonetheless, that is a safe play. He does, he is going to pass. And that's going to be incomplete. We stop him. A three and out for Alabama. Who would have thought that was going to happen? So we do stop him on his second possession, and we will put in the punt return. 
this time he'll probably nail it down there pretty deep so I'm gonna have to decide what we're gonna do oh no we're gonna return from there I'm gonna run it from there and that's a that's a nice little return uh, gets us some breathing room a little better than we had last time and uh, this time I'm gonna go off tackle with the running back Robinson to start and he gets a good run he's gonna get about eight on that so uh, or seven so that's second and three let's go line buck with Johnson And he's going to get the first down and a little more. So, yeah. I mean, the Alabama defense was very good, but it was supreme against the pass. Not quite as good against the run. Maybe good or average to good against the run. So, um, let's go off tackle with Robinson on first and ten. We're moving the ball. Let's keep that game plan going. Let's just run it down their throats until they can't stop it. So Johnson today has two runs for 12 yards, and um, I'm going to go line buck with Robinson. Now, of course, we risk overusing him, but he is getting the yards, and he is allowing us to keep moving the ball. So that is going to be something we would want to do. Um, let's go off tackle with Robinson. <laughs> I'm probably not supposed to be doing this. No, that, that time he got stopped pretty quickly. So, uh, no yards. Got hit at the line of scrimmage. Let's go look in past to the, to the tight end. Let's go look in past to the tight end on this. And uh, did he catch it? Maybe he caught it. He did. So he got five yards on that. It is third and five. I'm going to go end run with Robinson. <laughs> Robinson is like, my God, kill me. And, and now we got him in the, they got us in the backfield. So yeah, he's going to need to go back to the bench and get some oxygen and, uh, re and rest. So we're going to send out the punting unit gonna punt the ball at least we moved the ball and got it out of our out of the shadow of our own oh, we almost blocked the punt but it doesn't look like he actually did but it's gonna go into the end zone for a touchback it would appear so I am going to look for the run here now oh, he's passing is that incomplete or was it complete? Second and ten. No, it was incomplete. So I'm going to look for the run again. I think now he's going to go. And I definitely want to go to the run. And he does. And we do stop it after about four or five yards. Four yards. So he's got a third and six now. I am going to look for the... I, you know what? I just have an inkling here. I'm going to look for the run. No, he's passing. God. Let's hope it's incomplete. Could always be incomplete. But it isn't. It's a long bomb for a pass that gets tons of yards. But that's be, partly because I wasn't looking for it. We're still in a 0-0 game here, though, with three minutes left in the first quarter. I am going to look for the run. We're going to go back to looking for the run. No, he's passing again. He must love Bryce Young, and I don't know why. Well, that's why he hits another, <laughs> he hits another receiver in stride right down the sideline. And let's see after this play is uh, ended. Yeah, he's 5 of 11 today for 87 yards. Well, now we're going to look for the run because we're down. he's down by the goal line. And he does run the ball, and we do get him after like three yards, four yards. 
So he's got a second and six. I'm going to look for the run again. And he does run the ball. And we do get him in the backfield. So they lost a yard on that. Now I'm going to look for the pass. And they run it, but we do get him quickly. So now he's got to kick a field goal. We're, You know what? We're doing a pretty good job defensively against the Crimson Tide, i got to say here. Let's put in the kick block and see if we can block this field goal. We can't, but he's only got, th he's had three possessions and he only has three points for it. So uh, we're doing pretty good here against this Crimson Tide team, but we do have to start to move the ball a little better. Um, well, we've had two possessions. One time we didn't move it, the other time we did. I'm going to just uh, take a knee for the touchback. So we moved the ball on one possession, but we didn't get anywhere with it, really. I'm going to go flat to the tight end. Uh, he is triple covered, but he still catches the ball, which is kind of crazy. But uh, it was good for seven yards, so we're going to go line buck with Johnson, the other running back. The guy hasn't had the ball as much. But he only gets maybe a yard. Yeah, he only gets a yard. So we got a third and two. Going to put in tight end again. We're going to go line buck with Robinson. And he gets the first down and some more. So now I guess he was fresh. I guess after all that oxygen sitting on the bench and taking a little rest, he's ready to go. There is, however, this is uh, just the start of the second quarter. There's 14.27 left in the half. I'm going to try a short pass to the flanker. Maybe not looking for it right here, hopefully. And we could... Maybe get something. No, no. Off the fingertips, he misses him again. I got to stick with the run because for some reason they don't seem to be able to run the ball. We're going to go off tackle with our running back and we're offside. So that's going to be a penalty on us. Uh, we have a second and 15 at our own 42. This time I'm going to go long. I'm going to air this baby out and let's go long to the split end. Even though they're supreme, let's see if we can still get them. He has to take an outlet pass, but that's fine. He gets some yards with it. So, uh, yeah, we got seven yards on that. Um, got a third and eight. Third and eight, I am going to go look in pass to the tight end. And he does catch it, and now I got a decision to make because we're going to have a fourth and one coming up. Fourth and one, and they're even telling me, you've got to stay out there, and I will. So we're going to go line buck with Robinson. And he does get the first down. Followed the fullback lead, and he got the first down, and a little bit more. And uh, we have a first and ten at the Alabama 38. 12-23 left in the half. We're down three, nothing. I'm Now I'm going to try the long from here. Every once in a while you got to do this. you got to try the long pass. you got to see if you can air it out and get on him. And it's off his fingertips again. So statistically, um, our man Quinn is uh, Quinn Evers is or Ewers is not having a great day. He's five for nine for thirty-two yards, and we have a second and ten. I am going to go off tackle with Johnson, and he comes right up the middle and gets the first down. Crazy! That's crazy, baby. 
All right, so we are in field goal range. Now, it would appear, uh, even maybe for a college football kicker, first and 10 at the Alabama 22. Let's try the uh, line buck with Robinson. And he gets a few yards, gets us a little closer. I'm not playing for the field goal, I promise you, but we have to keep moving the ball, and they seem to be susceptible to the run, at least with our running game. 10.56 left in the half. we got a second and six. Let's try a draw play to Robinson. And he's going to get the first down right at the marker. He gets the six yards that we needed. I mean, we are riding him like a rented horse, but you got to do it. We're going to go short pass to the second tight end. And Ewers is back looking for this man, and he gets him for a touchdown! Texas with the lead. That was a sweet play, wasn't it? So, yeah, he's 6 of 10 today for 44 yards and a touchdown. And we're going to try the extra point, the regular extra point. We're not going to try to go for two or any of that crazy stuff. And we have the lead. Texas has the lead here by the score of 7 to 3. And our defense has contained Alabama pretty well. And remember, we're going to get the second half kickoff. There, but there is still 10.06 left in this half. So uh, this Alabama offense can still do a lot of damage to us. But we stop him right at the 20. Not the greatest return. I am going to put in the run defense. And he does run, but... For some reason, we weren't ready for that. Probably had the wrong defensive lineman in to look for the run. Um, I am going to look, I'm going to go balanced on this play. And now he is passing. But it's complete for a bomb. And he's down in our end, down at the uh, about the 28-yard line, 27-yard line. So first and 10 at our 27, I am going to look for the run. Let's see if we can hold him to another field goal. We do get his running back after um, not very many yards. In fact, he was dropped for a one-yard loss on that play. So they've got a second and 12. I am going to look for the... We're going to go looking for the pass. And he runs it. And we get him in the backfield. Nice! I mean, he shouldn't be running it like... I know that there's this game, you know... People run for the sidelines when, you know, the half is winding down. But he's not at that point yet, really. I'm going to look for the pass. I mean, we've got a uh, third and 14. Hopefully we can hold him here. We cannot hold him, though. And he gets the first down at the 15-yard line. Our 15. So you can see Young so far today is 7 of 13, 142 yards, but no touchdowns and no interceptions. Let's try a linebacker blitz. Let's just see what that does. That's not going to do anything, and he's going to try to pass the ball, and we get him right there right after he catches it, but he does pick up yards on it. Um... I am going to try a second and four. I'm going to try for the run. I'm going to look for the run. And he does run, and we get him quickly. He got either zero yards. Yeah, he got zero yards. We got back to the line. That was it. So he's got a third and four. I am going to look for the pass. And he is going to run. And what happens here? Uh, he got the ball back, but he has to try another field goal. He fumbled the ball and he got it back, but he's going to have to try another field goal, I think. I mean, he could send his offense out there, sure. Uh, but that's what he's going to do. He's going to try the field goal, so let's do the kick block. And uh, he still makes it, but he's only got six. 
And we lead it 7-6 to six with 6 minutes left. We have a little time to move the ball in this half, plus we're going to get the kickoff in the second half. So let's see what we can do here. I am going to try to run with the ball. And that is a nice run. That is a real nice run. Oh, my God, he got him. He was had a dude on him, too. But he did tackle him. And so we got a first and 10 at the Texas 44. I'm going to go flat to the tight end. And it's incomplete. All right, let's go off tackle with Robinson. And he gets a few yards, but we're going to have a third and long here, third and six. Third and six at the Texas 48. I'm going to do a look-in pass to the split end. And it does, he completes it for a first down. That was a key completion. We really needed that with uh, four minutes and uh, four and a half minutes and less winding down. In fact, three minutes and 53 seconds left here. Ewers today is 7 of 12 for 52 yards and a touchdown. Let's go off tackle with the running back, Robinson. And he's going to do well. He's going to run. He's going to run to daylight. And he gets down to the 30-yard line of Alabama. Nice. So we got a first and 10 at the Alabama 30. Uh, let's. I'm going to go line buck with Robinson. I mean, we're going to ride Robinson as much as we can because he is getting some good yards for us. And he's working us down there. Um, I am going to go flat pass to the second tight end. He's rolling and looking, and he completes the pass down deep now into the Alabama territory. We've got a first and 10 at the Alabama 12 with 2.44 left. I am not even going to call timeout. I'm going to go off tackle with Robinson. The train we've been riding all game. And he gets some yards. He gets us even closer. So we have a second and five. 2.08 left. Second and five at the Alabama 7. And I am going to go short, medium pass to the second tight end. I don't think he's looking for this. And it's incomplete. Third and five. Third and five, we are going to go line buck with Robinson. And there's a penalty on the play. He gets close to the first down. It would make a decision for me if the penalty's not on them. But it is, and I'm going to accept it. So it's a first and goal now at the Alabama 2. And we're definitely going line buck with Johnson. Not Robinson, because we've been riding Robinson all day. And it's a touchdown, Texas! So this is uh, pretty sweet, man. I mean, I'm, I'm getting a little cocky here, though. But Johnson on the day has four runs for 26 yards and a touchdown. We're going to try the extra point. We're just going to do the straightforward extra point. And we are now leading 14-6. to six. I'll bet you Nick Saban is ripping his hair out after this. Um, because there's only a minute left, and we're going to get the ball in the second half. A minute left in the half. And they should take that as a touchback, and they will. So we're going to look pass. I'm just looking pass. You can run the ball all day and, you know, twice on Sunday if you want. 
and uh, he's got Bryce Young out on his own and on the run, bootlegging. That gets him whatever it gets him. But it got him three yards. I'm going to look for the pass. There is a penalty on us. I think we were offsides. And then we get him deep in his own end, but I don't think it's going to matter because I think the penalty was on us. So he's got a second and two. I'm going to look for the pass. We're going to look for the pass because we just have to stop him from scoring. And he does catch the pass, but we're on it. There was only 22 seconds going into that play, so let's see what happens. There is 15 seconds left. He's got it first and 10 at our 37, and I am looking for the pass. Because he still has to get, I think, closer to, than that. A, a pro kicker would have a problem getting it from here. I don't know if that was complete or not, but if it was, it wasn't for very many yards. Second and eight it was complete, but for only two yards, we're going to look for the pass. Eight seconds left. This is basically the last play of the half. Let's hope he doesn't score a touchdown on it. And he doesn't. So he got maybe a yard or two on that. Third and ten. And that is going to be it for the half. So they're kicking off to us. I will look at the uh, halftime stats in just a minute. I think we're just going to take that, um, take it for a touchback. So uh, let's take a look at the box score for this game so far. Bryce Young is 11 of 17, 178 yards. He's got a lot of yards passing, but no touchdowns. And um, Quinn Ever Ewers is 8 of 14 for 63 yards and a touchdown. Um, and then we've got, uh, they've got Jesse McClellan, who has five rushes for 10 yards. Gibbs has four rushes for 17. Roydell Williams has two for 12. And Bryce Young has two for three. But we got Bijan Robinson, 14 rushes for 81 yards. And then uh, Rashawn Johnson, four rushes for 26 yards and a touchdown. So I am going to, let's go off tackle with Robinson. Not tired yet, so, you know, and, oh, we fumbled the ball, and it looks like he's, um, oh, okay, I'm going to, I'm going to fall on it. And there was also a penalty on the play. So let's hash all of this out. Ah, oh, that was on us. We got a first and 20. Uh, you know what? I'm going to go look in pass to the second tight end then. And did he catch it? He might have caught it in traffic. Yeah, he did. So it got, we've got a second and 15. I'm going to go short to the wide receiver. I don't think he's ready for this. I don't think he expects us to do this. It's incomplete. How do you miss that guy? He was wide open. All right. Um, we're up 14-6. I am going to do a look-in pass to the split end. I don't expect it to get us 15 yards, but... Um, we'll see what happens, though. Whoa, whoa, wait a minute. Oh, we're a yard short. You know I'm going for it. You know I am. Even down here, I'm going for it. I'm a gambler. And no, we are not going to do that. We're going to put out the pro set. No, we're going to put out the, uh, we're going to put out the blocking back. And then we're going to go line buck with the fullback, Johnson. And he gets the first down. I mean, shocker.
So we have a first and 10 at our own 37, and I am going to go look-in pass to the running back. Trying to change it up, and he gets a first down with that pass. We are moving the ball on this Alabama defense like I didn't expect to have happen. Ewers today is 11 of 18 for 94 yards and a touchdown. Um... I'm going to go draw play with Robinson. And he breaks up out through the middle for a five or six yard run. No, just three? Just three? All right. Second and seven. I'm going to go flat to the running back. Flat pass to the running back. Seems to work. Ah, he missed him. There was two guys in the area, too. All right, we got a third and seven. Uh, let's go. I'm, you know what? I'm going to go off tackle with Robinson. We're going to see what happens. Maybe he can get us close. Oh, he does not get us close enough. I'm not. I don't like that. I'm not going to. I don't think I am going to go for it from there uh, with a fourth and like five, fourth and four. Yeah, I'm not going to do that. We're going to punt. Let's nail him deep in the end and uh, in his own end and hope that he makes a mistake or that we can hold him again to another field goal instead of a touchdown. And it just dies at the nine-yard line. So it's going to be a first down for Alabama at their own nine with 10.36 left in the third quarter. And I'm looking for the run. I know he keeps passing and I'm I keep asking for trouble here, but... Well, we do stop him from getting a first down. Now he's probably going to run because he's close to a first down. He only needs a yard or two. He only needs two yards. I'm going to go. I'm going to look for the run. And he did. Looks like he did run it. And and we stopped him after two. But you know that's the first down. So it's going to be first and ten again for um, Alabama at their 19-yard line. Now I'm looking for the pass. I'm looking for the pass now. And they're offsides. That time I could see it. So the penalty will be on them. And I am going to definitely accept it. Oh, I guess they just gave it to me. That's great too. Uh, first and 15 at the Alabama 14. I am looking for the pass. And he runs the ball. But we get him quickly. That's nice. All right, so he's got a second and 13. I'm looking for the pass. And he is going to pass. And it's incomplete. And that's nice. So he's going to have a third and 13 coming up. This is great. We might be able to stop him here. I'm going to look for the pass. And there is a penalty on the play. Hopefully it's on him. I, we were right in his face. I don't know why we didn't stop him there, but hopefully there was this completion for a first down. Hopefully the penalty's on him, though. Nope, it wasn't. So he's got a first and 10 at his 46. I'm going to look for the pass, though. And there is another penalty. This is a penalty-riddled game. Not a very clean game at all. He got five yards on that. He's got a first and ten at the 46. So I'm going to look for the pass. And Bryce Young is out on his own. And we get him after about a two-yard gain maybe. Yep, two yards. So it's second and eight for Alabama at their own 48. I'm looking for the pass. And we do stop him quickly. He ran the ball that time, but we still stopped him. Third and seven, I'm looking for the pass. Let's see if we can stop him. The Texas defense needs to rise to the occasion here. 
and play big. They got to play big here. No, they don't. And in fact, they're going to allow a touchdown pass on this. So Alabama throws a long touchdown pass, and uh, let's see if he goes for the uh, two-point conversion instead of the uh, extra point. He is going to go for the two-point conversion. I am going to look for the run. And it's incomplete, so he didn't get the, did not get a, uh, I don't think he did. No, he didn't. So we're still leading by two. So we got a 14 to 12 lead, 630 left. I am going to try to run the ball. Let's hope we blow past a whole bunch of people and get some great yardage here. And we do. We're out to like the 38-yard line, our own 38. First and 10 for us at our 38. I'm going to go line buck with Robinson. And he gets a few yards. Not going to complain. Uh, second and six. I'm going to go flat pass to the flanker. He's For some reason, he has a problem with these high percentage passes, but not there. There he got a big yards on it. I don't think they were looking for it. I think they expected us to run the ball. And so we're in Alabama territory. Got a first and 10 at the Alabama 42 with 502 left. I am going to go, I don't think he's going to be looking for it here either. I'm going to go short to the split end. And he catches it for a first down at the 29-yard line. We're at the 29 now of Alabama with a first and 10. So we got a first and 10 at the Alabama 29. I am going to go off tackle with Johnson. And he gets a few yards, maybe two. Three yards. All right, three yards. I'll take it. We've got a second and seven. I'm going to go look in pass to the tight end. That's going to be incomplete. All right, we got a third and seven at the Alabama 26. I'm going to go off tackle with Robinson. He's probably not looking for the run. And Robinson gets us a first down. I am doing, man, my game plan today has been spectacular against these guys. So we got a first and 10 at the Alabama 19. 314 left in the first quarter. Um, I'm going to go line buck with Robinson. We're really riding him, but, you know, we got to. So that was only a pickup of a yard or two. The three. So we got a second and seven. I'm going to go short pass to the flanker. And it's caught, I hope, at the right at the first down marker. No, it's third and seven. All right. Uh, let's go short pass, wide receiver. He's probably absolutely looking for this, but... Oh, he got picked off! Oh, my God. Well, that was uh, unfortunate. Two minutes left in the third quarter. I'm going to look for the pass. This has been a mentally challenging game, but I've been I've been up to the challenge so far. We have a 14 to 12 lead on Alabama. Um, I am going to look for the pass again, and he runs the. No, no, he's Bryce Young out on his own trying to bootleg, and he doesn't get very many yards. Two yards. So we're going to look for the pass. 
obviously, let's hope we can shut it down right here. No, we cannot shut it down. And this, well, it won't be a touchdown, I don't think. No, it isn't. But he's deep in our end now. Bryce Young with a great, uh, great pass there. He threaded the needle. First and 10 at the Texas 27 for them. I'm going to look for the pass. 49 seconds left in the third quarter. We get him in the backfield. He tried to, uh, he did like a little outlet pass or something. In the back in the backfield and he got a yard. I'm gonna look for the pass. And he runs the ball and we get him quickly. So he's going to have to um, he's gonna have to pass here, I think. Third and nine. He doesn't want to settle for another field goal, although that would give him the lead. Bryce Young out on his own. Let's stop him. Or maybe not. Oh, we do. We do stop him right before the first down. So now the question is, what is he going to do? Is he going to kick the field goal or is he going to go for the first down? Field goal gives him the lead. And he is going to try to do that. Let's try the kick block and see if we can stop it. But we can't. So he does take the lead. 15. He now has a 15-14 to 14 lead. But we are in the fourth quarter. Kicking off, he's got a 15-14 lead. This is kind of just exactly like the real game. The real game was a 20-19 game with uh, with the um, with the uh, Crimson Tide winning it. But let's see if we, like I said, we've got a chance to change history here. And uh, I don't know what we did there, but it was great. But we're off. It might be us offsides. Maybe. I'm not sure. No, it was them. Decline its Texas ball on the Texas 39. Accept its Texas ball on the Alabama 46. Oh, well, we're going to take that, yeah. All right, so we got a first and 10 at the Alabama 46-yard line. Um, I'm going to do a look-in pass to the second tight end. And it's going to be complete for a first down and some serious yardage. Now, a field goal for us will put us ahead, but there's still a lot of time left in this game. So... Um, Let's go flat pass to the tight end. And I think it was complete. It was for four yards. I'm going to go off tackle with Robinson. And there is, uh, there was probably movement on us or something, but it's on us. Second and 11. Let's go long pass. I'm going to go long pass and see if we can get this right here. Because he may not even be looking for it. Oh, it was off his fingertips again. How bad is this guy, this quarterback? <laughs> All right. Um, we've got a third and 11. I'm going to go short to the split end. Let's just hope we can get some yardage here. And he runs the ball on his own. He gets it back to the 30. I could try a field goal. I guess I'm going to try a field goal. Yeah. We'll try the field goal, but I don't know how good this kicker is. And he's good enough to miss this kick. So we're going to give the ball back to Alabama with 11.43 left and down by a point. I'm going to look for the pass. He really should run the ball and just run the clock out, try to run the clock, but, um, you know, who knows what he'll do. He does pass it, and we do stop him after, like, five or six yards. Um, I am going to look for the pass again. What we need is something big. We need a turnover or a bad mistake. We get him in the backfield, so he's going to have, like, a third and five.
third and four. Third and four at his own 36. I'm looking for the pass. And we stopped him. Is he going to punt? That's the question. We stopped him just short of the first down. And he is going to punt. Nice. Put in the punt return. He doesn't want to take a chance down there. I mean, you know, because if we happen to stop him somehow, we would be right there in field goal range again. I am going to try to run the ball. There is a penalty, though, on the kick. And I'm going to accept the penalty. So he's going to kick from deeper in his end. And we're going to put in the punt return again. 9.18 left. We got enough time to get down there and win this game. Uh, but this time he gets off a booming punt somehow. Come on. All right, I'm going to try to catch the ball and run with it. And it gets nowhere. Probably shouldn't have done that. But anyway, so we got a first and 10. We're going to go. Well, we got to get out of here. Line buck to Johnson. And line buck to Johnson is really great. Nice play. Got us a first down. He got like 12 yards on that. First and 10 at the Texas 16. I mean, the problem is we've got to go a long way. But I'm going to go line buck with Robinson. And he gets a long breakaway run. Nice. Two big, huge runs. We've got a first and 10 at the Texas 29. I'm going to go line buck with Robinson. There is a penalty on the play. Hopefully it's on Alabama. It is. I'm going to accept the penalty. So we got a first and five at the Texas 34. You know, first and five, Texas 34, I think we've got a free play here almost. I'm going to go long to the split end. And it was an outlet pass, and again, he couldn't. This guy is terrible at passing. I mean, he is 15 of 28 passing, 144 yards, a touchdown, and an interception. So we got a second and five. I'm going to go off tackle with Robinson. Oh, they got him in the they got him in the backfield there. Third and four. Uh, not in the backfield, but he only got a yard. I'm going to go line buck with Robinson. And he'll get the first down. Nice. We just keep moving this ball, moving this ball. 6.02 left. Let's go off tackle with Robinson. And he gets a few yards. He gets like three yards on that. Yep. I'm going to go looking pass to the flanker on second and seven. And it's a first down pass. So Quinn Ewing comes, Ewing, Ewing, whatever his name is, comes up quick. He comes up big on that play. First and 10 at the Alabama 50 or at midfield. I am going to go line buck with the running back, Robinson. I mean, we've just got to get close enough for a field goal. There's there's uh, under five minutes left. Second and eight at the Alabama 48. I am going to go line buck with Robinson. Uh, he gets caught pretty quickly there, too. I think they're on to us. I think they're on to us, finally. Uh, third and seven at the Alabama 47. I am going to go flat pass to the tight end. He really has to complete this pass. And he does, I think. 
but not for nearly enough yards. Fourth, no, it's incomplete. Fourth and five. Fourth and five, and he does want us to go for it, and I can understand why. I mean, there's 311 left, so yeah. Uh, I am going to go short pass to the wide receiver. And it's incomplete. Well, if nothing, it's first and 10 for them uh, at, our, at their own 45. If nothing else, this was an exciting game. Probably much like the real game was. I'm going to put in the balanced. I mean, I don't really know now. I'm like kind of almost giving up here. Except we intercept the ball. And I'm going to try to. Uh, I'm going to try to gain some yards. We intercept. We picked off Bryce Young, but uh, we only have a few minutes left, though. So we can't really run the ball. We've got a first and ten at the Texas 33. We got to go. Look in pass to the flanker. And there's going to be a penalty on the play. Hopefully it's on Alabama. We do get the first down, though. So if the penalty's not on us, uh, we know we've at least got the first down. But it is. So we got a first and 20. I am going to go short to the split end. We've really got to hope that Ewing can get something here. He does a little outlet pass, and the guy runs, beelines it to the sidelines like they're going to do. Uh, Ewers, Ewers so far, Quinn Ewers is uh, 18 of 32 for 159 yards, a touchdown, and an interception. Got a second and 14. I am going to go short, medium pass to the split end. I mean, we got to get some yards. And he, again, they're going to do one of this, like, beeline it for out of bounds thing. Which is just eating up time and not getting very many yards. Got a third and six. You know what? I'm going to take a chance here. I'm going to go off. I'm going to go off tackle with Robinson. Oh, they read that one like a book. But there's only a couple minutes left here. I got to go for this. So fourth and six. I'm not going to call a timeout. Or should I? No, I'm not going to call a timeout. Uh, minute 15 left. I am going to go short pass to the flanker. And it's going to be incomplete. Way incomplete. I mean, we really were not, uh, you know, the clock and everything was just working against us there. So I'm going to look for the run. He should be running the ball and just run the, the clock out. And that's what he's going to do. Um, second and five, I am going to look for the run. And he does like a quick shovel pass. Gets a few yards. I'm not going to call a timeout. I just want the game to get over. We're not going to stop him. And we sack him. Or he does the victory play thing. And that is it. Game is over. And uh, we will take a look at the uh, report, the box score. Final score 15 14, much like in real life where Texas lost 20 to 19. Bryce Young was 16 of 25 for 315 yards, a touchdown and an interception. 
and Quinn Ewers was 34, was 19 of 34, 167 yards, a touchdown and an interception. Um, for us, Robinson was a workhorse, 27 carries, 142 yards. And Johnson had seven carries for 45 yards and a touchdown. Um, I'll let you look at the receiving stats really quickly if you're interested in uh, how the receivers did. I don't usually go over those. There's a lot of them. I'm not going to read them all off. But uh, that is it for me, Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke, signing off.